to all those young Americans, the most diverse generation in our nation's history, what do you say to some of them who may doubt that they can one day achieve the same great heights that you have? Thank you, Senator. Um, that was very moving. And I appreciate the opportunity to uh, speak to young people. I appreciate it very much. I do it a lot for the reasons that you have articulated. I, um, I hope to inspire people to try to follow. Um, this path because I love this country because I love the law because I think it is important that we all invest in our future and the young people are the future and so I want them to know that they can do and be anything. And I'll just say that um, I will tell them what uh, an anonymous person said to me once. I was walking through Harvard Yard my freshman year. As I mentioned, I went to uh, public school and... I didn't know anything about Harvard until um, my debate coach took me there to enter a speech competition, and I thought, this is a great university. It was basically one of the only ones I'd seen, and I said, maybe I'll apply when I'm a senior. But I get there, and whoa, <laughs> so different. I'm from Miami, Florida. Boston is very cold. Um, it was... Um, it was rough. It was different from anything I'd known. There were lots of students there who were um, prep school kids like my husband, <laughs> um, who knew all about <laughs> knew all about Harvard, and, and that was not not me. And I think the first semester I was really homesick. I was really questioning. Um, do I belong here? Can I can I make it in this environment? And I was walking through the yard in the evening and a black woman I did not know was passing me on the sidewalk. And she looked at me and I guess she knew how I was feeling. And she leaned over as we crossed and said, persevere I would tell them to persevere 